In Ta-Nehisi, we collected hands and heads to show we were victorious in war. It's my job. But in the Levant, which is the biblical area of Israel, they did things a bit differently. In Genesis, we learn the Hebrew word for foreskin is orla. This word was used to show Yahweh's covenant with Abraham. That's at Genesis 17, 11. Again, foreskin is orla. Strong. And Saul said, Thus say ye to David, the king desires not any dowry but a hundred foreskins of the Philistines to be avenged of the king's enemies. But Saul thought to make David fall by the hand of the Philistines. Wherefore David arose and went, he and his men, and slew the Philistines two hundred men. And David brought their foreskins. And they gave him the full table to the king, that he might be the king's son-in-law. And Saul gave him Michelle, his daughter, to wife. How did the Israelites collect Philistine foreskins? That's my question for Tazaria. How? The prepuce is part of the penis. Again, how did Israelites collect Philistine prepuces? A hundred Philistine foreskins. But he brought back two hundred. <laughs> what ISU PK got to say about that? Yeah, I see y'all like that cartoon scholarship. I see y'all like them Looney Tunes. Help us look into this, bro. Don't swing that curveball. <laughs>